it was kind of interesting because I wasn't sitting in front of my computer, so I wasn't micromanaging situations. When I did leave on Wednesday, I actually was very long the small caps in the XBI, but I was also I also sold premium in the spies where we went further than I thought and the Qs. So I had to actually sit tight into the CPI. And thank goodness on Thursday they actually sold down the spies, they sold down the Qs, the small caps of the XBI and the equal weight spies went nuts. And you had to really manage it all, and it wasn't that easy. But again, a lot of things in my process that saved me money. What? I got stopped out of some Amazon shares. I got stopped out of some Meta shares and I was able to sit tight in my short queues and spies. Didn't cover the best, but I was done with my spies short and queues on Thursday. So that bounce back Friday, which was kind of insane, didn't get hurt in. I also held my IWMs for a big move, which if I was in my desk, I probably wouldn't have. And I'm still in the XBI coming into this week. That was then, this is now. Everyone's like, Red Dog, how did you handle it? And also remotely, looked like the two best stocks that bounced back the fastest from Thursday into Friday was Tesla and Apple. Meta was down, Google, um, Amazon. I feel like people are so pissed off about that move that got contained by the Jeff selling that no one was excited to get in there. And now here we are.